Well, hi there, everybody, and good Thursday morning to you. Meteorologist Travis Klineski back after a couple of days off here to attend a conference. That was right here in Hastings, actually. A bunch of us weather nerd types uh, got together for a conference here, the High Plains Regional Conference of the uh, Regional Chapters of the uh, National Weather Association and American Meteorological Society. Some great information there, so it was a very good uh, time. But again, back in the saddle today, and it looks like uh, kind of a similar day to yesterday, although our chances of rain are fairly low during the daytime hours today. Looking at your future calendar, we do have a lot of clouds and some fog out there this morning, a mild start to our day. I do expect mainly dry conditions, those, those clouds slowly give way to at least some sunshine, kind of like yesterday. It took a while, so it will be warm but not terribly hot. I think hotter the farther southwest you go with more sunshine out there, but it will be a bit on the sticky side. We really focus our attention out towards the west though late this afternoon and into tonight as showers and storms roll off the high plains. Move into western parts of Nebraska this evening. And uh, that's probably going to be the best chance of showers and storms, but even though future cast really dries things out by the time we get towards tomorrow morning here in central Nebraska, I'm going to keep a chance of showers and storms in just in case they do actually hold together because there is that chance there's some forecast models that show that happening. And they even kind of keep them into the daytime hours tomorrow. Once again, partly to mostly cloudy skies, warm but not too hot. And again, there's going to be that chance of showers and storms, focusing a better chance as we head towards tomorrow night with that activity that develops off towards the northwest. As for what we have temperature-wise today, I think it'll be cooler the farther northeast to go, where clouds will likely linger the longest. So upper 70s and lower 80s up north, mid to upper 80s as we head back towards the west with, a, I think, a little more sunshine compared to other areas. Uh, same down in northern Kansas, I think a little more sunshine, upper 80s to around 90 degrees, a little bit cooler with the clouds lingering a little bit longer around the tri-cities with both lower 80s. Uh, for this afternoon and now towards the east upper 70s and low to mid 80s with those clouds again lingering a little bit longer especially as you get farther to the northeast your extended forecast temperature wise still going to be looking at generally low to mid 80s in the next several days to come many off and on chances of showers and thunderstorms out there but I can't say that uh, it's going to be widespread every single day. If I had to pinpoint a time period with the best chance, that would likely be Saturday night. That's when I think we'll see the most widespread shower and thunderstorm activity. So right now, just kind of breaking it down here, I have about a 30% chance tonight for the, this is kind of more specifically for the Tri-Cities, but 30% chance tonight, 40% chance during the daytime hours tomorrow into tomorrow night, I think especially towards tomorrow night. Saturday daytime hours, about a 30% chance will likely get away with maybe dry conditions most of Saturday. Saturday, but by late in the day Saturday into Saturday night those chances again about 50 50 lingering into Sunday now as we get towards early next week just a slight chance of a shower storm Monday into Monday night likely going to be dry on Tuesday into Wednesday but by Wednesday night maybe a better chance of showers and storms rolling back in as we do warm it up maybe a little bit towards the middle of next week but not terribly hot out there and it's going to be a little bit sticky these next uh, several days to come with those humidity levels those dew points getting back up into the mid and upper 60s like they have been the last couple of days so that is your forecast for this thursday until next time i'm meteorologist travis klineski hope you have a great day